Happy Friday. I hope you're having today. Happy Productive Friday. My name is Mauricio Garcia. I want to welcome you to the Conquistador podcast. This is the podcast where we talk only about the things that can help you really excel in business. And to do that, we get to hear from the one and only, the Hall of Fame entrepreneur, who happens to be my friend, a mentor, and partner in business, Mr. Hubert Humphrey. Hubert. How are hey, you but, today? Uh, I'm doing great. It's been a great week. Uh, I, I always lo- love these Friday broadcasts because it's, it's sort of the capstone on a great, great week of, uh, of opportunity for all these wonderful entrepreneurs out there. Absolutely. Well, I've really enjoyed the whole week. Uh, go th- I'm again going through the whole the history, you know, mission that uh, you are on and ha- secrets and just everything that we provide in the podcast. So, Today, I want to talk about some of these successes, right? Because you said success leaves clues, and you can't really be, if you're really successful, you can't be kind of like just successful by yourself. You have to create other people who have success. You've created wealth for other people, right? You've, you've, you've added value in other people's lives. And I want, there's, there's a lot of people out there um, right now making millions and millions of dollars. And... When you make millions and millions of dollars, if you're doing it ethically and if you're doing it um, the way it's supposed to be done, it's because you're adding, you, you, you are contributing something to, to, to the universe, to the world more specifically. And so can you point at some people that have followed this system, that have joined you in the past, have joined you now, that have tr- completely transformed their lives as the testimony not not just yourself, because you know they. Anybody listening to the podcast who's done a little bit of research on you know that um, you were instrumental in building what the great Primerica company out there knows that uh, you were the founder uh, of the great WMA now World Financial Group uh, out there. Know that you lead the Hegemon Group International, probably the the biggest of all time here on on, on the way to do that. But there's a, there's a lot of people that have uh, followed your teachings, have followed the system, that are having great success out there. And I want to talk about those uh, other people as well. I think well, it's a good a, thing for the Friday. Well, it is. It's a good thing. And I can, I can just kind of go through a whole myriad of them that I want to point out here. I look back in our beginning days in uh, – we had uh, we we had in our in, in our in the decade of the 80s there where we were building the big ale uh, ale Williams which became Primerica. Look at the guys that were doing some stuff there. I mean I look at the Bob Safford who became multimillionaire there with us. He he had been an in, industry executive that made a switch and came over. I look at I look at Mike uh, Mike Sharp out in Southern California, up and coming young young guy that jumped in and followed the the, the nucleus of our system. And uh, and and Elvis became a, a, a just a multimillionaire and today. Still makes five, four, five, six million dollars a year. Some forty years later, from 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 the team he built, and, and just because of the nature of the financial services products that that we market. Then you look at him. You look at uh, the, the the Ronnie Barnes, and who was a school teacher, and Warner Robbins, who became a multimillionaire, and uh, mm. uh, Bob Turley, who was used to be a pitcher for the New York Yankees back in the old golden era of baseball. Uh, what, to, to watch him become super successful, all those guys, and then, 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 then in, then in the in the, the group that became the, the the World Marketing Alliance team that I brought over with me there to see to see Rich Stolle. Rich Stolle was sort of my was sort of my my, my best example. He mm-hmm. he was a guy that was he had just gotten married to his wife Cindy uh, just maybe a few months earlier, living out in San Jose. Uh, he, he, he was working at San Jose State University for about fifteen, sixteen thousand dollars a year. He, uh, and, and he, he was on the side, he was doing some work with his father who had a landscape, commercial landscaping business, shoveling horse manure out there for fertilizer. And so that was what he was doing. And he gets into our business and he loves our system and he follows it. And I, I, I'd moved out to Denver from Macon, Georgia to open up the West. And, and all of a sudden now I'm, I'm opening up California and we'd opened up the San Jose here about two or three months earlier, and he uh, and some people led us to him. He comes in, and in a short period of time, he locks into me. He becomes a, the great copier. He's one of the best copiers I've ever seen. I mean, he copied exactly everything 
that we did the system. He, he, he didn't just copy the outside. He copied my thought processes, my feelings, my emotions about it, and, and was able to go out and build an empire. And still today, he's, he's multimillionaire. Mm-hmm. And later, uh, later, a swan win, uh, 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 a little, little guy that had come over for, 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 with his family, dodging bullets, jumping from boat to boat from Vietnam, couldn't speak English, gets into the business. Just a glorious accident. He even found our business. Uh, and, and, and he got into our business, and, and, and uh, uh, he's an 8 to $10 million a year guy still today, some 30, uh, t- t- 25, 30 years later, built a big empire. And, uh, and, and, but it, 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 these guys had none of this back, none of them had ever been in the insurance business, none of them had the skill sets, none of them had been in any kind of business. They had different backgrounds, different, different mentalities. I saw, the, I saw Monty Holm, a little, a little guy that had been out on a mission for our church, and while he was out there, I had a little organization going in Raleigh, North Carolina, and he, one of the people at church, he, he, he knew they were involved in this business, so he goes over and looks at it because he's about to go home from his mission back to St. George. And back then, St. George had maybe ten or 15,000 people in it down in the desert up there in southern Utah. He goes back as a young single guy, uh, hears about our business, contacts me. I've just got to Denver, and I'm just opening up Denver. You know, I just didn't really think a young single guy uh, you know, 21 and single was going to be able to make it. Uh, mm-hmm. So I kind of put him off a little bit, but his burning desire was such that I, I couldn't deny it because he just stayed at it, got him started. And from that little sing, young single guy who eventually got married, moved over to Vegas and then other places, I mean, he literally built a, him an empire and became multimillionaire in today's extremely wealthy. You know, and uh, just a, just a, he's a philanthropist. He does all kind of things. Those I could go on and on and on about those kinds of people. So you got it's a, in today's in today's company. We've got superstars that are making tons of money. Uh, Aki Rupani, Aki Rupani came over from India 12, 13, 14 years ago uh, to 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 be uh, to be sort of an entrepreneur and got involved with some, some family and friends and. They bought up a few gas stations here and there, and some investments, and, and he just got went, went working hard. I mean, it's just sort of it's just like having your own job. You just sort of have these businesses, and they become your boss. And he just worked, 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 and he was doing doing okay, but he really realized that he was limited, and he 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 he, he had he wanted something that we could leverage himself better, and he and he found financial services. He ended up getting into a world marketing, a world financial group, the company we had built before. And uh, I was able to kind of see a little bit about the system that was still in place and learned a little bit about the recruiting side of it, S- educated himself on how products worked and how the concepts and things of that nature. And it became good. It built him a little team, about a core group of about 100 really good licensed people, had about a half million dollar a year income for that first two or three years. And then later he realized that he wanted to do it bigger and that he knew that I was the architect of it, and I'd gone on and started a new company. So he, he looked, he ch- checked me out. Later, ends up making a, a leaves over there, comes over to our new company, Hedgeman Group International, and has started over here with us. And uh, and here in his this three three and a half years, he's he's built a he's built a team out there with with a with about twenty thousand people. He's got. He's out there making this. This year alone, he'll make five million dollars in his in his when he completes his fourth year with us, and he's produced. There's about four other guys out there making over a million dollars a year. He's got tons of them making a half million, and it just just probably, probably a seventy-five to a hundred of them out there making a hundred thousand in his new group. So, I, and then I then I see a new little group like Francisco, like like Rafael Presidiado out of Salt Lake City. A little, little boy that originally came from Mexico, and here he lives in been living in Salt Lake for many years, and uh, and he he recruits through social media. He recruits a, a a little guy that came up with his family from Venezuela two mm-hmm. or three years ago, and doesn't speak good English, but wants to be somebody. And he had tried a bunch of different things in this two or three years in America, and he decides that he would he give us a try. He liked what we saw and came up to see us in Atlanta. We We've worked with him and got him going, and in this three or four month period of time, he's become he's become a, a, an RMD with us, produced an RMD. He's, he's, he's they're starting to move up in our leaders' bulletins. You see him and his team in the top tens now, 
and he's up there now. He, 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 he'll be getting his $100,000 club ring here. And it took him about 90 days, and, and, he, and he, he speaks broken English. He's got a great spouse yeah. named Sylvia who helps him, a lot of great people all over. So, so he's building, so, and, and Raphael is building all over the country. And, I, and our Raphael now is a, probably, will probably make a half million dollars this year, for, and, and this is his second real year of learning our system. So guys, we got, we, and I could go on and on about people. Ragu Reddy, uh, up under his deal out there, uh, he makes a ton of money. Prashant, Mirage Car, uh, I could, I could, you got Lothan and Srinivas Mara, Maram out there. Uh, I mean, I, I, we, we just got dozens and dozens of these guys making a million dollars a year that that are out there. And it's, and these people, they, they, they're just like you. They're just like, they're just like me and you. Uh, and, and, and I and I, I just look at all these people out there in the country today, looking, looking for opportunity. I told you some numbers early in the week where there's yes, yes, just, yes. Just, just just in the service side of things, there's uh, there, there was almost seven hundred, six hundred eighty, almost seven hundred thousand people quit in April alone just in the service sector. Those people are looking are for looking. more. They're looking. Those yes. are the very same people that we turn into people making $100,000 a year. Mm-hmm. We, we, we give them a whole new career and a whole new industry with all the support that they'll ever need. And so I just tell people from all walks of life, this, this, this is a, they need to become the next examples. We need to, on future shows, we need to be talking about your name, your name, and your name. You, you come in here. Hey, we run a hero-making machine. You come in and follow our system and do what you got to do, and we're looking for heroes. And boy, we'll put you on our scoreboard. We'll put you on stage in our great meetings. We'll send you all across the world on great trips of the lifestyles of the rich and famous. We we give you the pins, you know. Plus, you make the money and you and you control your own future. And those are just bonuses, obviously. Those oh, are just yeah, those are just yeah. nice perks. Uh, and everything, but uh, but just the opportunity to change your life to uh, producing the income. I know money is not everything, but it definitely helps you give people. Well, but you, you look know. at another, look at someone like yourself, Mauricio. Mauricio, you, I could I couldn't show a better example than Mauricio Garcia, of a guy that's become building great wealth, making tre- tremendous income, is a great example of being in our business. I mean, we're, we're looking at him on the screen right here, and he I, I see so much of myself in him. We, we we come from different backgrounds, different nationalities, but we're kindred spirits in what we what we're doing here. The key guys is that uh, we we we're in the largest business industry in the world, which is financial sense, the money business. Mm-hmm. You, you, it's it's like the what business should you want to be in? You should want to be in the money business. And when money is moving, fortunes are made, and we're right in the built middle of the largest intergenerational wealth transfers in history of the world. It's going on, has been going on for the last 10 or 15 years, and will go on for the next 5 to 10 to 15 years. Yeah. And you need to be a party, of it, party to it. And as money moves, fortunes are made. They just need to be your fortunes. Come you know, on. I Absolutely. No, absolutely. I want to say this, that um, where could you keep extracting, extracting for 40 years? You know, there's such a huge problem that not just Hubert, but we're talking – hundreds of thousands of people and millions of, of lives been touched you know with uh with because of the problem and with the system but what i'm really trying to say is that you, you've mentioned i don't know there were dozens of people you just mentioned just to name a few of people who's changed their lives uh thanks to the system thanks to the industry and that uh that the opportunity is greater now than ever before because of those numbers and because of the demographics you you were just talking about and everything and um and so the point i'm making is that if you are looking right now for an opportunity that is truly puts you on a very solid foundation to build something over the next 20 30 years or even longer it has to be the financial industry. It's the largest industry in the world, the only industry that's measured today in over 100 trillion. I looked at last time I looked at uh, real estate and retail, and even those two industries combined don't even match over 100 trillion dollars in, op- in you know in potential. So, so do yourself a favor. I remember it was a weekend when I uh, because only the weekend could I escape from my traditional job to go take a look at an opportunity in the financial industry, changed my life forever. So now that it's Friday 
And um, now that you're listening to this podcast and you hear this message, this invitation, this opportunity knocking on your door, it's a good, it's a good time to go and check out um, what this is all about by going to hgiopportunity.com. That is hgiopportunity.com. Get involved. At a minimum, learn about it. Compare it to anything that you've seen, and you will see that there's simply no match if you do your research. And if you get close and let Hubert uh, listen to the entire Hubert presentation about why this is the industry you want to be involved in and why you want to be involved in it with us. So with that being said, I wish you guys have an amazing weekend. Hubert, I wish you have an amazing weekend as well. Thank you for always being here, adding the value that you bring to this podcast. And we'll see you on Monday to keep this movement going. We'll see you guys. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. Warning. This podcast may change the way you think about business, entrepreneurship, and money forever. The Conquistador Podcast was created for dreamers, entrepreneurs, and leaders who want to conquer their future. 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 To be an epic entrepreneur, you must adopt the right mental paradigms as well as master the art of selling, marketing, and finance.